Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VIII. Last we left off, we pretty much kill kidnapped the fake president and uh, were yeah, be pretty much beat it to a complete dead twice pulp. And now we're gonna go ahead and do whatever it is we need to do. Go to the local TV station. Ha ha ha! Oh, I forgot to talk. <laughs> but the local and transcontinental trains have stopped running, sir. Nothing to worry about, sir. There must be someone in town who knows. <laughs> You're ready yet, sir? Yeah. Well, best of luck, sir. I'll be keeping watch here. Hallelujah. A guy dressed as a cadet gathering information. He was asking about the president's stay. I found it strange that a cadet would keep asking about him. He was very polite and kept addressing me as sir. I think I know who you're talking about. He was taking care of three suspicious looking characters from Balaam. I could question every teenager in the area. No, we can't just go up to anybody on. Ugh. Look, these are citizens. We can't inflict any. How dare they try to kidnap the president! Not only is it disrespectful to him, but also to us Gabalian soldiers as well. I'll be sure to find them and throw their sad behinds in jail. <sighs> Please, hear me out at least to the very end. <sighs> yeah, here we are, go into the TV station. Because there is nothing else that we can do. <laughs> That's actually what we're supposed to do. Uh, good luck to us. <laughs> oh, say, I remember now, sir. I think the TV station is located behind a building called Timber Maniacs. Please head in that direction, sir. I hope you find it. What? Come on! The Kabadian soldiers are coming! Plus, I could guard the drone city now. Please be careful, sir. Seems like the hotel's not available either. You need to recover. Use the owl's tear, sir. You heard it works wonders. Uh, I think you can find it at the old man's house. <laughs> I guess you won't be needed in any way. You're all see, so you'll be fine, right, sir? Oh, hey! Hey! Don't leave me, sir! Oh, God. <laughs> it's, like tw it, uh, it's like Three Stooges act, almost. Except not really, but it's close enough. Anyway, if you need... Uh, I suggest going to the pet shop up here, because you can get some... Ah, here we go. Uh, get get some dog magazines, which I suggest you get if you want to learn more moves for Vinoa's uh, pet dog, Angelo. Now, let's see what number three and number four give. Let's see. Show the relationship between moon and dog, no dog, use power, moon, help, invisible moon, mysterious power, make allies invisible, do a lot of walking, help, learn trick. Okay, good. And number four. Ever been KO'd by monster? Reviving doesn't help because KO'd right back. Answer desperate call. Use Angelo reverse dog. Find Phoenix stands. Revive KO Mart members in battle. Okay, it's good. That was like some severely crop reading. <laughs> I only picked the important words. Anyway, so there's that. You get a couple of uh, new. Th <coughs> oh, excuse me. I got a couple of uh, things to use there. And let us go ahead and see. Yada yada yada. Blah blah blah. Oh wait, the, the pet shop. I want to show more stuff. These are all things that you can use for your GF. If you choose to use it. Now, of course, these things aren't cheap, obviously. I mean, even the magazines weren't exactly cheap. But, once you get more money, you can always come back here to any pet shop and learn these basic skills. Now, it seems like that all GFs would know these moves. Uh, item, draw, GF magic. Not true. Not all of them know those moves. Stupidly enough. But, uh, no, we'll, we'll get to that bridge when we get to it. <laughs> and my, I... There we go. Controller disconnected again. God damn it. And I think if you talk to... Move it, boy! Oh, I forgot there are enemies here. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, go body and soldiers! And you know what? Uh... Do you... Do you know... Wait, I, 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 oh, oh god, uh, shoot! What am I doing? Oh, I was using the wrong thing, whoopsie daisy. 
Okay, uh, you know what, just, just die. I don't care. They're super weak and it's just a waste of time. I mean, if you wanted, you could, uh, do magic refinement. And you can just get a, like, a crap ton of, ma of upgraded magic. By that I mean, if you already, oops. If you already know mid-magic refinement, you can go ahead, like, do a blizzard and refine and just... Oh, I, there we go. And do that. I'm not gonna do that because... Reasons unknown. I am not gonna be going a hundred for each person five times. I, I am not that crazy. <laughs> I'll be bored to tears. Anyway, if you talk to her, I think she... I lied. I'm trying to... Oh, I have to actually look in here. Oh, Timber Souvenirs, duh. Anyway, Owl's Tears. We're out of stock. The old man living on the edge of town would have some. How about a map of Timber? Oh, I'm sorry, it's not for sale. But I'll show it to you. You want to see the map of Timber? This is the worst map I've ever seen. In my... This is the world's worst map. What the hell? No, it's not easy to understand. Uh, screw you, sir. Model trains are out of stock. Watch them zone bought the last one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Controller, please. I can't sell naughty magazines to underage kids. Eh, but zone is regular here. I sell them to him sometimes. I think he was looking for a book called Girl Next Door. You should tell Zone about it if you ever find one. Yay! Naughty magazines! And we're underage kids despite being old enough to work covert operation missions. It is very awkward and odd, but I won't mention anything. Anyway, so... Oh, there's Timber Mania, so that was easy. <laughs> uh, I think you can steal from people's houses, question mark? Can I? I don't know. Do not quote me on that. Hey, there's a boy doing a handstand. Wanna take a look? See? <laughs> Go to that window over there. Did you just talk to me like a normal kid? Anyway, so you can look out the window if you wish. And you see that there is an alleyway back here. And that's all you have to do. Well, yeah, I mean, you don't have to do that, but that's all that you can do. Anyway. That's 10 gil, please. Oh, wow, that's some extortion right there. <laughs> hey, you at it again? Uh, uh, um. How many times have I told you not to take money from people? Uh, I, I reduced the price from 1,000 gil, though. It's not about the money. I didn't raise you this way. You don't have to pay me. Yeah, that is. <laughs> well, um, yeah, um, I actually did <laughs> forget that that scene existed, so it was worth it to come up here? Question mark. And I'm right now. Uh, <laughs> that was ridiculous. Anyway, uh, give me one moment. I'm actually checking something real quick, like, and I am blah 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 blah. Okay, I'm done. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah. There, there, there's a greedy ass little kid who's just trying to extort money from people just to look out a goddamn window. I re I reduced the price from one thousand gil though. No. Anyway, here we are. Let's go. To Timber Maniacs. I think he said it's in the back. And I think you can get something from these magazine stacks. These are all the battle series. I read all of them. Hello, what can I do for you, honey? Nothing, I just want to... Ooh, the silent type. <laughs> I like that. Okay, I'll leave you alone so you can have a look around. Old magazines. Ah, there we go, girl next door. There we go, and as we heard, Zone wants those adult magazines, so we're gonna go ahead and get them. Oh, I actually... 
<laughs> I accidentally found a draw point, but you know what? Sure. Because this is Blizzaga. It is a stupid ass strong magic. Obviously. Um uh, I was gonna uh, uh I know I only drew seven, but is it enough to do anything in terms of junctioning? You're not you're not Leon. Please. Thank you. It is so not enough for anything. <laughs> I just thought I'd give it a shot. Okay, I'm good. Yep, but yep, there's Blizzaga right here. A nice, strong-ass magic. It, oh, boy. Uh, yes, I know. Thank you so much. Oh, I can't... Oh, God. I'm gonna have to find a way to get behind Timber Maniacs. Yada, yada, yada. That, no, that's not what I wanted. There's an obvious one on the floor. Thank you, God. <laughs> Timber Man like I keep trying to get Timber Maniacs, and it kept bringing me to these two idiotic ones. Anyway. Uh... Okay, so, no. Uh, there's... He... Uh, Watt said there's a way to get to... To the place behind Timber Maniacs. Oh, God. And basically, if we look out the window, you, we see that there's an alleyway that leads behind Timber Maniacs. So we can just go ahead and find a way to the alleyway and skedaddle our on to the, uh, to the, uh, would you please stop it? To the, uh, TV station. Wow, Renoa's power- oh yeah, because she has magic equipped, no duh, that's why- that's why Renoa's powerful! <laughs> anyway, so, to get there, basically, have a good co mental compass. The alleyway's behind these two buildings, so that means somewhere along the line we're gonna find the alleyway entrance. Uh, and it was on the floor, like a uh, ground fruit level. So this are stairs, we go down. It's just basically using your mental map. <laughs> that was too easy, man. For a country bumpkin, he sure had some good stuff. Yo, better ease off a little. These timber hicks hate us enough as it is. Let's get him! Wow, we got some bullies here. <laughs> well, you're in for a rude awakening, sir. We're about to beat your asses in the next century. Oh. There you go. It's like you, you withstood that attack very well, unfortunately. You are asleep, and you are dead. There you go. Bye! <sighs> anyway, yes. Going to the pub is the correct direction because, based on the mental map, that is how the alleyway would work. Ooh, we received a card! Yay! I did... I know. There are so many battles in this little town. All Galvalian soldiers truly hate us. Oh, God. I... <laughs> I mean, I don't know why they hate us, but... Well, actually, if you think about it, you just heard that little scene that they're basically bullying people. And, uh... They're, they're basically bullying people, if you will. So they're bullying all of us, and we're just, uh, sir handing their asses to them. There are no trains to the desert I know, I didn't want to go there, you dumb. There we go. Found some cure that we can't do anything with. We have a man here that has a shop. H Hello? Jesus Christ, I just wanted to talk and then you're like not letting me talk to you. And if you want, you can order up some... <clears throat> some materials. I don't order materials because I don't feel like it. Bye, sir! Alright, so let's head into the pub. I had enough of this city. I came here from Dolly to have me a good time and now... <laughs> trains are no longer running. Can't even stay in a hotel because of some stupid official. Harassed by Gabonian soldiers. My precious guard stolen. Oh, this just hasn't been my day. Those jerks. They think they can get you brute force to get anything they want. <laughs> Hell, this town's a good example. Yeah. Everything's jacked up because of the resistance trying to kidnap the president. Thanks to them, the trains have stopped. There's Gabonian soldiers all over the place. All because of them. 
don't they understand that I'm the one suffering from the reckless actions? Stupid boneheaded good for nothing resistance. Well, you can just kiss my ass. Hey! You don't understand anything. The resistance is fighting for Timber's future. They're doing. They're all doing the best they can. It's the Gabadian soldiers and their leader who are at fault. Well, anyway, from that rant, you might have heard something very important. He got his card stolen just now. Well, let's talk to the poor man. Excuse me, sir. We need to get through. Jeez, now I'm getting ditched by some punk. I want to give you another drink. Well, I'm not going to buy you a drink. <coughs> But I think I will tell you about this card. Does this happen to be yours? Huh? Uh, it is! Hey, why do you have it? Found it outside. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Thanks. You know what? I'm feeling generous. You can go ahead and keep that card. And also this one. I'll move out of the way now. Yay, we got a Tom Berry card! <laughs> Iona! I can't stand up. Can you help me? Oh wow, this guy is drunk off his ass, probably. <laughs> that animation is funny. It's like, scoot. It's like, scoot. It's not even standing up, it's just scoot. Oh, anyway, let me check how much time it's been going. Yeah, 16 minutes. I can do this. Yeah, we can go. Uh, hello. There we go. So let's go on ahead, we're in the background, in the background, we're in the back alley now, some kids are looking at us. We the Weezy stunts, cowed, but the president will be dead meat next time, next time. Do you really know about the, whatever, shut up kids. <laughs> I'm not even pressing A and they just keep talking over me, so it's like, screw you kids. There's a draw point here, for scan to, eh, uh, selfie take it, why not. Yay, selfie, you got some scans. And into the police department. Police department. <laughs> into the TV station we go. Yay. Yep. This back alley leads us to the TV station. And here we are. I think it says emergency broadcast. Hey, an outdoor TV. This is creepy. What is it? This noise is broadcast over most of the frequencies. Something has to be done about this before before they can broadcast it over the air. Right on! The president's in the studio now, sir. Too many guards now, so we won't be able to storm the place, sir. So we can't just rush in. Well, we gotta come up with a new plan now. If the president leaves, maybe the guards will be gone too? That's when we do our broadcast. It might not be as influential, but it's better than nothing, right? We don't stand a chance if we take him head on, right? Don't worry about us. We'll fight your enemies based on your decision. That's our duty. Hey, I'm a C2. Just want you to know I'm ready for anything. How sad. <laughs> and act on act on my decision. That's your duty? Oh, what an easy life it must be, just to follow orders. Call it what you want. All we want is for you to achieve your goal using our help. I find it hard to believe that you can do it, though. What did you say? If you have something to say, just, just say it. Fine, I'll tell you. How serious are you? Really? The three of you plop down on the floor to discuss strategy. On top of that, you can't make a decision without our input, right? How do you think we feel working for such an organization? You're being a little too hard. Fine. You know, maybe this was all a big mistake. I thought everything would work out fine once Seed came to help us. But I guess it's not that easy, huh? You were all hired. It's not like you're one of us. Let's see. We'll cancel the plan and we'll disperse for now. 
We don't stand a chance if we take him head on, right? So you guys probably think this is all a game to us. Well, it's not. We're serious. So serious that it hurts. Uh huh? They starting? Testing. One, two, testing, testing. Oh, p people of the world, can you see me? Can you hear me? Oh, this is incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a recording. This is an actual broadcast over the air. Yes, it's been 17 years since a live broadcast has been possible. <clears throat> oh, please excuse me. I seem to have lost my composure. We would like to present to you today a message from the lifelong president of Galbadia, Vinza Dilling. Ladies and gentlemen, President Dilling. Greetings. I am Vinza Dilling, lifelong president of Galbadia. Today, I stand before you to make the following proposition. We, the people of this world, have the power to end all wars. See? See, it's a peace proposal to the world. I knew it. Unfortunately, there are some trifling problems standing between Galbaria and other nations. They must be resolved. Huh? I plan to convene with other nations' leaders immediately to resolve these problems. At this time, allow me to introduce the ambassador who will be my representative for the conference. Tch, man, all this just to introduce an ambassador? The ambassador is the sorceress. The sorceress. Huh? Hey! Uh, Cypher! Oh my! What's he doing? Inspector Trap, stay back! Leon, oh, Leon, what are we gonna do? For the last time, stay back! You're only going to provoke him! Nothing. Our job is to assist the owls. It's none of our business. Timber Team, are you watching? Get over here right now! You have permission! I need your help! Squad leader, Leon. <sighs> no, the uh, things just took, just things kind of went south immediately, unfortunately. We need to restrain him. What do you think you're doing, Cipher? <laughs> it's obvious, ain't it? What are you planning to do with this guy? Planning to do? That's right. He knows we're Noah. Is that why he's here? Oh, I get it. You're Renoa. Shut your damn mouth, you chicken wuss! <laughs> he broke out of the disciplinary room, injuring many in the process. You... You stupid idiot! Cell, please... Be quiet. Instructor, I know. You're gonna take this stupid idiot back to garden, right? Shut up! No! I see. <laughs> so you're all from garden. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Well, should anything happen to me, <laughs> the entire Garbadian military will undoubtedly crush garden. <gasps> so... You can let go of me now. <laughs> nice going, chicken wuss. You and your stupid big mouth. Take care of this mess, instructor and Mr. Leader. Thank 
Thank you so much, Big Mouth Zell. Thank you so much. I, I, I ought to stab you and then shoot you and stab you again. Uh, well, anyway, we're going to just go ahead and call an end to this video because I want to call an end to this video, so let's do it. Mm. Thank you so much, goddamn Zell. Anyway, is there anything behind the podium before I... I can't even get to the podium, can I? Never mind, there's nothing on the podium. So... <laughs> Bye, everyone, and hopefully... And we'll see what problems happen thanks to Zell's big mouth. Ugh.